I just finished up my live Zoom class and I decided to come up with a little bonus fit in 15 for you. I'm going to give you five exercises, one minute a piece. They're combination moves. And then at the end, we're going to string all of those exercises together for a really super challenge. You ready? I'm going to set my timer. I've got my hit timer going. I've got 15 seconds for my countdown. First exercise is a combination. It's going to be a curl to press. And then I'm going to do side, front, side, down. Three, two, go. Curl to press. I'm going to try to get as many of these as possible in one minute. And when we're done with all of these exercises, we'll have, we will have hit every single muscle in the body. So right now we get shoulders and biceps. We get a little bit of chest right here. Boom. Curl to press. Side, front, side, down. Curl, press, and down. Side, front, side, down. Curl, press, so as you learn these exercises, by the end, we string them together. Eight seconds left. Probably time for one more full round. Side, front. So I got 10 seconds here to show you the next move. Squat down. Jump back. Open the feet. Give me a push up. Feet together. Now my timer is going, so I'm going to go. Squat, jump, open, push up, feet together, jump into squat. Jump back, open, core is tight on those push ups. Remember, it's quality over quantity. Halfway there, open. Elbows are tight to the sides on those push-ups. Working my chest, working my tricep, getting my legs right here. Open. Jump forward. Down and back. Open. Jump forward. And that's time. Next move is a renegade row. Feet are Slightly hip width apart, a little bit wider than my hips. And I do time and alternating renegade row. Pulling the elbows up, past my ribs. This is definitely more challenging than it looks. Abs in, you wanna to try to keep the hips from rocking side to side. That's why I keep my feet a little bit wider than my hips. Whew. 20 seconds left. time. I move my weights out of the way just to take the pressure off my hand for the next move. It's a downward dog to a horizontal squat. What does that mean? Hips come up to down dog, rock forward to plank, hips go back, I look like I'm squatting, and then I rock forward. Timer's going. Down dog, plank, hips go back, my knees don't touch the floor, I launch forward. Down dog, Forward, hips go back, rock forward. Down dog, plank, hips go back, launch forward. Crown of my head, faces forward the entire time. I don't look up, press the hips back, come to plank, squatting back, launching forward. 15 seconds. Working my core, 
work in my upper back, feeling this in my quads. Time for one more and 10 second rest. Last move, we're gonna stay in plank. We've got the L formation mountain climb. What does that look like? Right knee across and change legs. My timer is going. This is the fifth move. Knee across, knee across, knee across, knee across, forward, cross, shoulder over wrist. Ooh, my arms are shaking a little bit. That's a good thing. More than halfway there. tight. And time. So I'm going to turn my timer off. You've got all five moves now. Here comes your bonus. We're going to put them all together in one combination. Ready? Curl to press. Curl. Press. Down. Side front. Squat down, jump back, jump back, open up your feet, give me that push up. Now right here, give me that renegade row, bring your feet together, down dog, come to plank, horizontal squat, butt goes back, rocks forward, L, mountain, jump forward. Rise up. How about we do that two more times? Curl, press, down, side front, squat to jump back, jump back, feet together, open, push up, renegade, one arm row, bring the feet together, down dog, plank, horizontal squat, launch, mountain with the L, Jump the feet forward and apart. That wasn't a really good L. Last time. Curl, press, lower, lower, side front, squat down, jump back, open, push up, one arm row, feet together, down dog, plank, horizontal squat, L mountain, Cross, left leg, cross, jump forward, and rise. That is your challenge if you decide to take it. Have a great weekend.